Hey guys, how's it going? Um, just want to let you guys know, it's uh, it's midnight when I'm recording this, so I'm I'm pretty tired. Um, I want to record this because it's just something that's really been bothering me lately. I haven't really been happy uh, with myself for the longest time. And I don't know. It's just something that's just really been bothering me. I haven't really found something that I haven't quite enjoyed like thoroughly. There's just I just feel like that there's really nothing out there for me that I haven't really accomplished or, you know, haven't really Done. I mean, I've, I've, I've tried this YouTube thing, and I have 670 subscribers. That's pretty good, but, you know, it's it's not the best. I'm not popular. I'm not famous. I'm not PewDiePie. So, you know, it's, it's not something I'm very proud of. But, you know, it's also something that I've always been very appreciative of. for. So, you know, don't, don't take that as me saying that I just don't give a shit. It's... it's Really something else. Something that's just really been bothering me. And it's just, you know, I guess I could say that it feels like that I'm not trying hard enough. I threw away, you know, I, I threw away $300, nearly $400 for... Um, for this, for this uh, switch, for getting the switch, getting the games, and getting a, a micro SD uh, that I I just got this weekend, um, you know. So it, it's 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 really nice. I I love this fucking thing. So you know, pretty nice. I I really don't know what I would do without it. I mean, other than getting a PlayStation 4, which, again, is the eventual future. But, you know, at this point, I just, I don't know. I don't think I really want a PlayStation 4 right now, even though I keep saying I really want to get one. And, you know, in a way, I do. I really do want to get one. But, you know, at, at, at the way I've just been, like, spending money left and right, I just threw away $300 again. Uh, but this time for, you know, for something that I think will really, you know, put my mind to ease. Something that I've been really wanting to do for the longest time. So, I just want to go ahead and say that... The one thing that I've always loved with all my heart, other than sports entertainment, is racing. I've always loved the concept of race, or at least, you know, racing in general. Being NASCAR, IndyCar, Formula One, uh, Formula E, or, or uh, the Grand Prix, or the Grand Prix, or, you know, whatever the fuck. Is on TV that involves with racing, and that includes video games, you know, real life, dirt racing, stuff like that. Stuff that you either see on TV or see on YouTube. Stuff that you can like, you know, get get to see like what how the drivers view or you know what 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 the drivers see. I've always loved that. I've always, you know, if there was anything that I wish I could have done after high school, I really, really wish I had pursued becoming a race car driver. Because, you know, it's just something I've always wanted to do. I've always, always wanted to, like, become some kind of a race car driver. And, you know, it's still very much a passion of mine. I'm, uh, I would absolutely love 
if NASCAR came to my door tomorrow and asked me to fucking learn how to drive a race car and then become a, a NASCAR driver. I would absolutely love that because that's just something I think I would absolutely love. And, you know, there's, there's a lot of danger in becoming a race car driver. There's, you know, the danger of death. It's one of the only fucking sports that, you know, risk of literally just dying by hitting the goddamn wall. But, you know, with future, well, with, you know, the technology these days, you know, I, I feel pretty confident if I was to become a race car driver, I would feel very, very confident to, um, to go out, learn how to race, learn how to drive these cars and become a, uh, become a race car driver or a NASCAR driver or something, you know, whatever. You know, it's something I've really, really wanted to do. So I went out and I bought myself, um, the, it, it's being delivered, I want to hope, Thursday. Um, I, well, yeah, I hope it's Thursday, but I'm getting a feeling it's probably going to be Friday or Monday. But if it is this weekend, then I'm going to be really, really happy about that. So, you know, there's that. But as of now, it's saying between Thursday and Monday. So I'm hoping that it's Thursday. But there's an 80% chance it's going to be Monday because, you know, it's guaranteed those four days at least. So, And I don't think Amazon's going to deliver um, to my apartment. Um, or at least over the, the weekend, so I might have to wait until uh, next Monday. But I have a racing wheel delivering here on Monday, and I have a um, a racing wheel stand being delivered on Wednesday. So I'll at least have the racing wheel stand set up uh, by the time the uh, the wheel shows up, hopefully this weekend. So it, uh, the stand's coming Wednesday. The wheel is coming uh, Friday, I hope. Uh, I probably need to, I need to grab some tools. I still need to grab like a screwdriver for my um, for my vacuum so I can screw the goddamn handle on. But you know, it's just something. Th this is something that I've really, really wanted to do. Okay, I've always wanted to try i racing. If, if you guys don't know what iRacing is, iRacing is basically um, racing esports. Kinda. I mean, there is an esports uh, surrounding iRacing. And hey, if I'm good enough, maybe they might want to take me on. Or, you know, some team might want to take me in or something. I don't know. I mean, I personally think if I am good enough, that I could potentially live off of that. But I don't know how that works. I don't know if there is like some kind of way you can either earn money or win money by w winning races or winning some kind of a championship. And you win like, say, a certain amount of money. Say like, I'm just throwing numbers out there. Like, I don't, I really don't know. So this is why I'm throwing numbers out there. So say like maybe $10,000 or something. What's $10,000 going to get me? It's going to get me 10 months of rent. That's what it's going to get. But, but what it's really going to get me, well, besides 10 months of rent, probably paying off like five months of, um, of my car payment that I, pro uh, that I think I owe. But, you know, I don't know. I mean, I don't know if there's a $10,000 pool or, or something like that. Who, who really knows? I don't fucking know. If there is a pool like that, hey, maybe I should get good enough. Maybe maybe I should get good enough. And maybe they will, um, you know, contact me one of these days if I do happen to get good enough as 
you know, an iRacing driver and compete for a pool of money that's like set at who knows how much, like a million dollars for whatever fucking reason. And I just so happened to win. I don't know. I really don't know. But, you know, it, it'd be pretty cool to win, um, to win some kind of, some amount of money. But I really don't know how that works. I know you earned, like, some kind of credits and you could transfer that into money. But I don't know how the credit to, to dollar um, value is. So I don't think that's really worth quitting my job. Or, yeah, quitting my night job. But, um... You know, it's something I'm not willing to do. Not unless Twitch decides, you know, my, my Twitch streaming decides to kick off. Which brings me to um, the next subject is Twitch. Um, first of all, I do apologize that I haven't been streaming, like, pretty much at all. And it's mostly because of the way I've, I've been feeling. I just feel like I don't have anything to do. I feel like whatever I stream, there's always somebody better than me. And, you know, the, the same goes with iRacing. There's probably somebody better than me at iRacing. And, you know, that's probably, you know, actually, that's the whole spirit of racing. Is that there might be somebody better than you. But you know what? That's the beauty of racing. Because you can get better. You can become better at racing. Especially at video games. And it might be it might just be luck. And it might just be skill. I think it's both, personally. But you know what? With a certain amount of luck and a certain amount of skill, you can pretty much do anything. So, you know, I just keep finding myself very, very unlucky with where I've been. And right now, I'm, I'm very much not happy with where I'm at. I'm not seeing numbers that I keep, you know, I keep wanting to see. You know, I, I keep expecting, you know, subscribers after subscribers here on YouTube, and I keep hoping for followers after followers on Twitch, I keep waiting for that moment when, you know, somebody might donate to me or somebody might subscribe to me on Twitch or somebody might um, support me on Patreon and whatever. But, you know, I, I don't know if any of that's going to happen. But, hey, that's why I have it all set up. That's really why I have it all set up is for that purpose. It's for if somebody wants to support me. That's the whole reason why I have all this set up. I'm not forcing anybody to support me. I'm not begging anybody to support me. I sure might be complaining about it a little bit in, in these videos, but you know what? At the end of the day, I'm still enjoying my job. I still have my car. I'm still living here in this apartment. So, you know, even though I've had some help a few times with my parents. I'm very, very grateful for that. But at the end of the day, if I can't support myself, what am I going to fucking do? I'm pro most likely, I'll probably have to move back to my parents' house, or if they will even let me back in. But, you know, at, at the end of the day, I don't know. I really don't know. Because I really enjoy my internet here. Um, I'm enjoying my time here alone. I really don't want to have to move back. Because that's going to be... That's going to be pretty tough, having to move back. But, you know what? I, I guess that's just going to be life. I don't personally think that I'm doing myself justice... By just doing this job, getting this apartment, getting a fucking car, and then just going for it. I don't know. Because I'm hoping that one day my Twitch will just kick off and I'll have 
enough people for affiliate and then Twitch partner and then going from there, I guess. I don't I don't really don't know. Because my current goal is to just get as many followers, subscribers, donations, Patreon supporters, just as many people that want to support somebody like me. I mean, this is the literal reason why I still have a night job. So, you know, at this point, it really doesn't matter. And I would be recording this off, uh, off my phone, but it's almost dead. So it's the only reason why I'm recording it off my laptop. But, you know, like I said, at the end of the day, um, just got to do what I got to do. If, if YouTube isn't going to work, I really don't know what I'm going to do. But I'm, I'm really trying to get my Twitch to go. So, you know, it's really the only reason why I want to do Twitch. Because I, I know for a fact that YouTube's going nowhere. Or at least for me, it's not going anywhere. Or at least I don't feel like it's going anywhere. I'm not seeing the numbers that I want to see. On Twitch, you can pretty much stream whatever you want. And again, there's always going to be somebody better than me. But you know what? I'm just having fun at the end of the day. I don't know what people want to see. I really don't. If people want to see some idiot fucking fucking off in um, in virtual reality, hey, I'll fucking I'll, I'll do that. But you know what? At the end of the day, VR chat crashed crash my last two streams. So, I'm definitely not going to be playing VR chat anytime soon. I would love to. I personally would love to. I would honestly love to stream VR chat, but I don't think this laptop can handle it. Or if not the laptop, the headset. Because my stream has crashed multiple times, and I personally think it's the headset that's doing it. So... You know, as soon as I get an Oculus, and so, as soon as that is all set up, then yeah, we'll. I'll try doing this again. We'll yeah, we'll, we'll try uh, streaming VR chat. And um, I I really don't know. Speaking of VR chat, I want to go ahead and give a huge shout out to. A very, very good friend of mine. His name is Igbar Von Squid. And I'll put his channel in the description below. But the thing is, is that he has way more subscribers than me. So I, I don't know why I'm giving somebody who has way more subscribers than me a shout out. But he made a video, a two-hour video, uh, dedicated you know, to all of his friends. And, yeah, I'm very, very appreciative that I had a chance to meet him and to hang out with him and to, like, have fun with him when, you know, I had the chance. So, you know, I'm probably going to just copy words from Roman Reigns here, but you're not, you're not guaranteed another day. So you might as well just enjoy it while you, you have the time. You're not guaranteed tomorrow, so, you know, just fucking go have fun. Don't fucking work yourself to death. Every weekend, do something different. Don't just sit on your fucking couch playing video games like me. And I should probably do that a lot more, too. I, I should probably stop wearing these fucking pajama bottoms, fucking get, get my pants on, Go out for a fucking drive, or even just go out and walk somewhere. Just fucking walk and see what fucking happens. I don't know. Actually, walking around this fucking area might be a bad idea, so I might just have to go drive anyways. So, I don't know. Just, just go outside. Have some fun. Or, you know, go on VR chat. Meet some people. Have some fun. So... 
you know, just do something. I don't know. I mean, I don't feel like VR chat is dying personally, but I feel like everything on VR chat has calmed down since early last year. I don't know. But, you know, It's people like Igbar that just, you know, it makes me happy that I, or it makes me glad that I, I've met the people that I've met. You know, without Igbar, I wouldn't be spending, er or yeah, I wouldn't be spending every other or every s some Saturday uh, at his place just chilling and watching anime or, you know, watching anime that I may or may not be interested in. So... You know, I'm very, very thankful for that. And sometimes I'm not able to stay for very long since I get tired pretty much right at 11. So, depending on the anime, just really depends, I guess. But, I don't know. So, uh, so yeah, Ig Igbar, he's a very, very cool person. He's a really good friend, or at least I think he's a good friend of me. I personally think he's a pretty good friend of mine. He's ve he's a very chill person. Seven fucking seven thousand subscribers, so. You know, I think I think he's doing very well for himself. He's not taking taking anything for granted. I think he has his own shit to worry about. And he's very he's a very good map developer. I, I mean, I just I love hanging out with the dude. And you guys may have seen me um, hanging out with him on uh, on New Year's. I was definitely hanging out with him. During the new during my New Year's stream, which again I haven't really uploaded because I haven't really found the time. So <laughs> I haven't found the time nor the editors, but I can promise you it's coming. <laughs> it's coming very soon. You know what? I might just end up saying, you know what? Fuck it. I'll edit it. Maybe this weekend. If if somebody can remind me to edit anything this weekend, it'll be that. So, you know, just whatever I can do. Um, Death Theater Reborn has been postponed until next week because I just haven't found time to record. Personally, because of my mental instability. Um, you know, again, I just haven't felt like wanting to do anything. I streamed, I think, for a little bit on Saturday, but I didn't stream anything Sunday. So I, f I feel really bad not being able or not streaming, but, you know, being that I prefer streaming on the weekends and then streaming in the mornings whenever, you know, I want to stream. I just really haven't had the energy to stream. I haven't really felt a reason to stream. With my wheel coming and my with my wheel and my stand coming soon, I'll definitely be streaming high racing. So, yeah, definitely. Um, whenever I get the wheel and the stand all set up, I'll definitely get the uh, subscription three months for I think ten dollars using some kind of a promo code. I can't remember what promo code, but I'll use it. And um, I'll definitely start doing that. I don't, I don't know. Um, I, I don't know how uh, how everything's going to work. I don't know how long would it be. I, I don't. I really don't know how things work. 
So I'm probably going to have some help. I'm probably going to ask some help. And we'll probably figure it out together on stream. Um, but if somebody that is a part or the uh, happens to venture to this video and would like to help me out when that time comes, um, hit me up. Hit me up on Discord. Or hit me up here uh, in the comments. Just you know, leave me with your Discord and I'll message you whenever. Anywho, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up here uh, because it's been almost 30 minutes, 25 minutes, over 25 minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and end it off. Other than that, my life has been pretty swell. But, you know, like I said, I haven't been feeling myself. So, you know, I'm sorry if, if anybody has contacted me and hasn't really received a message from me. That's mostly because just haven't been feeling it. So if I don't message you, don't take it too personal. Just know that I'm not in the right place. And I hope to be in the right place come this weekend when I get the fucking steering wheel, hopefully, um, Thursday or Friday. I'm looking forward for it. So, you know, four, four freaking days. I'm really looking forward for it. Uh, I'm going to be very, very excited for it. So I really can't wait. I don't know if I'm going to test it before I um, officially get iRacing, but we'll probably have a test stream, uh, a wheel test stream on, on Friday when I play Euro, or if if not Euro Truck, then American Truck Sim, because that's, that's a game that I've always wanted to try with the wheel. Oh, with a wheel. So, with a wheel, I, I got a wheel, a shifter, and um, the pedals with the clutch. So it's three pedals. The, th the three pedals are the three pedals and the shifter are literally for Euro Truck Sim, Euro Truck, and American Truck. Primarily, so I can have my shifting fix <laughs> because I've really. Uh, the truck that I use at my current job is an automatic. And as much as I enjoy being an automatic, I have a fix. Or I have I have this itch that I can't scratch without a fucking shifter. So I, I, I really want, you know, to just do shifting again. So if I can do that in um, an American truck, something that would be great. And I'll just start doing that. Anywho, um, I'll just go ahead and get off then. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, if you guys enjoy this video, leave me a like. If you want to support me, hit the subscribe button. And if you do, don't forget to hit that notification button so you get videos. Or so you get notified whenever I post a video, do premiere, or go live, which is pretty much never. Also, please, please, please follow me on Twitch, which is my main streaming, you know, thing that I want to do every day, pretty much. Um, with a break, probably every... I'm going to choose Thursday as my break. I'm going to choose Thursday... I could, I'll probably choose Wednesday and Thursday... Uh, because I prefer to have two days off. Mostly because, I don't know, I, I, you know, for the past month, I want to say for the past couple of months that I've been streaming literally every freaking day, just I just run out of energy. I just don't really know what I want to play. I don't know what I want to do. And I end up running through games like really fast. And I'm like, man, I just don't know what I want to play. So tomorrow we might play, or, you know, this week we might continue to play doom. Uh, or I don't know. I, I really don't know because I've been really enjoying, I really want to play doom again. You know, it's something that I've really enjoyed playing. So, you know, there's that. Um, so, yeah. I'll, I'll definitely attempt to stream starting tomorrow or starting today, whenever, um, at my usual time at around 9 or 10 in the morning until I have to go to work or until I feel like I'm done streaming. But, um, 
but yeah, that's. Uh, I hope to play Doom. Uh, maybe some other games that I have on the side. I know Firestorm is is uh, is about to be released on Battlefield. Yeah, on Battlefield Five. So I'm probably going to try that out sometime soon. Uh, we might go back and play um, just Battlefield Five multiplayer. So you know, have, scratch that itch, scratch my shooting itch. So yeah. Uh, who knows? I certainly don't, but you know what? We'll, we'll give it a go. So we'll take Wednesday and Thursday off. I'll, d I'll, d um, I'll take that off my Streamlabs, Streamlabs schedule, and uh, we'll, we'll go from, basically, we'll just go from there. So, yeah. I don't want to freaking just run myself out of energy. That's not something I'm willing to do. So we'll definitely take Wednesday and Thursday off for just... Take a break, you know. Take a bit of a break instead of just announcing when I'm going to take a break or just choosing a random day out of the week. So whatever. Anywho, I'm off. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.